Hey guys, what is up? The Neocubist here. Welcome to episode 35 of my Minecraft 1.18 Hardcore Survival Let's Play. So, this weekend I literally have my biggest project, in Hardcore Minecraft at least, planned ever. And uh, I gotta tell you guys, it's really exciting. I'm not gonna spoil what it is, we're just gonna prepare. If you want a teaser, you can go to my Instagram, and I know like you're like, oh, Neo, you're, it's it's 30 seconds in the video, and you're already uh, plugged into your social media. Yeah, if, if you really want to know what what's about to happen this weekend, or, or not even, you're not, you're really probably going to be more confused, but you can find my Instagram just at the Neo. Oh, okay. As I get shot by a skeleton, at the Neo Cubist, so same as my YouTube username. So I went on vacation. I also got engaged last two weeks ago. And, uh, yeah, so things have been pretty crazy, guys, in my life, and, uh, I'm very excited. It's, I think it's been, like, three weeks, though, since I've recorded, um, which is absolutely insane. Um, and, you know, I may be a little off, I may be a little slow, a little quiet, I don't think I'm gonna be slow, but I might mess up quite a bit. So, we've gotta do a ton of preparation for this week's project. Now, you're looking at that picture on Instagram, maybe, or maybe you didn't look at it. Uh, but if you did look at it, you're probably like, uh, what? And keep in mind, you don't have to have an Instagram account. Like, you can just search, like, you know, my username on Instagram and, like, look at the first picture. You don't have to have an account. So, you can go in your browser, your phone browser, whatever. Uh, but anyways, I, like, I can't explain, okay, I don't want to spoil it. We gotta do a lot of preparation and a lot of fun preparation. And I know I'm just kind of running around randomly. Um, but that's because I'm not quite sure exactly how I'm gonna do this because I don't think I have a silk touch pickaxe. Uh, oh, I, wait. <laughs> yeah, I do. Uh, also, I don't need all this kelp. I really, I, I don't need all the kelp. Um, and then all this stuff in here, I think, was for when I was lighting up my fish tank. So if you look over here, I think we did this on the video, though. I honestly can't remember. I was so ready to be done recording. Last week, I was feeling kind of burnt out. But I think having a three-week break has ignited my uh, interest in this world once more. Yeah, so I was lighting that up. There's just a ton of stuff I'm not going to need. So I'm just going to throw it off. Um, just let them eat it or whatever. I, I think we can find a spot in our uh, thing in here. I don't know. W would this be rare? You know what? I'm gonna classify glowstone as somewhat rare. How about that? So we're gonna need a ton of storage. We're about to get a ton of stone. And uh, the problem with that being I don't really have a lot of like storage. I might use the mob drop box, honestly. Um, and if you remember, whenever we build projects in this world, we just kind of randomly throw things. So uh, maybe we can unload some of these random stone type materials and stuff like that. And hello, Mama Kitty, how you doing today? You want to get up and walk around a little bit? Okay, you want to sit on the chair? You want? No, we're not gonna. S <laughs> I love cats, man, but they're out to get you. They're uh, yep. Okay, well, that's exactly what I'm trying to do right now, and I think she knows it. Okay, well, I got her sat down over here. I think that's fine. And you can get warmed by the furnace. Uh, but yeah, there's just all this stuff in here that I really don't need right now. Um, I'm gonna need to get a ton of smooth stone. We're gonna have to move the beacon. We're gonna have to get a bunch of stone. We're gonna make a cool end end portal entrance. So I don't really remember where the end portal is, if I'm honest with you. I think I have the coordinates on a uh, on a video clip, or or no, no, I took the coordinates and I put them on my phone. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I'll have to remember. But we're ne we're needing to get smooth stone, which looks like we already have quite a bit in here. Uh, we need seven thousand four hundred and forty-three. So I calculated it because I built this out on a creative world to make sure that I could like get that many materials. It sounds like a lot, but it's like three inventories full of stone. Um, so this will give us enough room. So go ahead and plop the ender chest back down. Um, we could keep these in our inventory. That's okay. We probably don't need all this stuff either. Um, okay. So let's go do a few preparations before we go and grab. Uh, that stone, like, namely grabbing the beacon. That's going to be the most important one. It's going to be pretty much impossible if we don't have the beacon. And as far as it goes for making the end portal entrance good, I think I'm just going to dig, like, a straight hole down to it or something. I don't really know. I, I think eventually I'll have something different for that. Uh, but for right now, I feel like that's good enough, and I feel like that's kind of cool looking. Now, I do have to make sure and bring some gold with me. That's one thing I cannot forget. All right, well, let me disassemble this thing real quick. I promise you, you're not missing much. And I'm not going to forget this time. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's nine by nine, and I won't forget it this time, I promise. But I wanted to ask everyone out there, how are you guys doing right now? I, I, I want to know genuinely. <clears throat> Write it in the comment. Let me know how you're doing. See if you can make some friends in the community. Let's try to be kind, everyone, because I'm sure some people aren't having the best time right now. 
So if, if you're having a good time, would you go in the comments and find someone who's not having a good time and, uh, you know, reply to their comment and be sweet to them, you know, be nice. And let's see if we can make some friends today. Because that's, the, you know, you only got a short time on this earth and you might as well make some good friends while you're here. So let's see if we can, you know, you don't even have to make friends, but, you know, let's just try to make someone's day. And I hope, I hope everyone who's having a bad day, I hope it can be a little bit better while you watch this video. And uh, I hope you find a way to make it a little bit better. And if that's not possible, I really do apologize. Okay, so. Uh, it's becoming night. We gotta go back in. <laughs> we can't. Well, what were we going to do? I guess we're going to get smooth stone, which is underground. So it re actually, yeah. Quite frankly, it doesn't matter if it's day or night. So let's just find an area to do that. Nah, this is too perfect. I I don't I don't want to ruin this whole area. I I don't really mind if I have to like you know go into a hill or something. Let me just make sure that this hill is. Yeah, this hill is thick enough for us. And by thick enough, I just mean if, if I start going back into the hill, I want to make sure I don't, like, come out the other side and end up making a tunnel or something. So we'll just dig straight into the hill, and that's actually good. We do need coal. Um, we're going to have to smelt all of this stone and get the smooth stone. So when you smelt, like, this stuff, you get that, like, cool-looking stone. That's what we're going to be looking for. So let me drill this back in, make a big room. I'll put the beacon down, and then I'll come back, show a little bit of mine in the stone, because it's not too exciting, but uh, it always is satisfying to see it go... You know what I mean? Oh, I just spit all over my windscreen. Oh, man. So this is definitely something we're going to get to use our super smelter for. it. Now, I just broke a bunch of dirt in here. And uh, it kind of, you know, it's going to help me out. Because you got to get, you know, a decent sized room. And then you have to dig, you know, something straight up for the beacon. That part's not hard. But, you know, getting the room is a little, uh, you know, because that's has to be a minimum of like 10 by 10. And this is only 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then 10. Really, you want to do it like 11 by 11, so <laughs> I got I, I got quite the project here, you know, digging out a big old square. Like, this is 2, be 3, 4, 5, 10, and then 11 again, so, you know, a decent sized room for sure, uh, but it's not going to take too long, but yeah, let me get to it. I know I keep coming back. I'm sorry to bother you. Dude, I'm not going to lie. I'm getting really lazy here. I'm like, I don't want to dig out this big room because the second I get this thing built, right? Like, it's going to make this extremely fast to, like, break out the area around this thing. So, I'm, like, literally trying to do the bare minimum to break this little tiny room out. When, you know, you're, oh, no, you Minecraft YouTuber. You should be the best Minecraft. Look, I'll be honest. You know, everyone is human here, okay? So, we all got to understand. Do you guys play Minecraft, like every week for three years do you do it no okay so sometimes you get lazy okay uh sometimes you get bored okay um so you got to understand if some weekends they seem like you know oh the content's not that good or you know maybe i'm, I'm struggling to get some content out and i'm having to force it right then then i like i am sorry i'm only human this weekend is quite the polar opposite i'm actually super duper hyped and i know i'll i'll, I'll even you know sometimes I'll, I'll i'll just be straight with you. sometimes i lie and say i'm hyped but i actually am hyped because this is something i've never seen done before something i've never done before and i'm hoping that people see it and they're like oh dude this is sick bro it's something like that you know not in that voice you know maybe like I can't, I can't do a girl voice. I'm sorry. I feel like I'd offend someone. If I, was, yeah. <laughs> I, can't, I can't do it. Me, me and Lauren have this running jokes, which is my fiance, by the way. We got engaged. You know, if I didn't say it, you know, I know I did. Um, but I, I always try to like mimic her voice, and she always says, "No, you're not right," because I can't do a girl voice. I try my best, but does anyone here? Can they do like a, you know, like a, a womanly voice? Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so now we need to dig a hole straight up above the beacon. Just like this. And uh, yeah, this is the most fun part. You just get to go straight up. Now, luckily, we're not too deep in the ground, so I can't foresee this actually being very difficult at all. Um, but I'm going to do it. Oh, yeah, see, look, I, I'm pretty sure that's the, the grass layer already. If it is, I'm going to be like, bruh. If there's a tree up there, I'm going to be like, bruh. I think it's good. I, th I think actually that's fine, right? Yeah, okay. I was like, there's no way, bro. No way. So I want the haste to check. That's right, guys. I'm hip with the beacons now. And now, check this out. Hyper speed! Okay, so I am going to do this for quite a while. I'm not even going to break the area out around the pyramid. Who am I kidding? Why does it matter? This is temporary. I'm here for one thing and one thing only, baby. St 
I almost said smooth stuff. Okay, guys, can, can, can we have a discussion? Can we have a discussion? When Minecraft came out, you know, a long time ago, like 11 years or 12 years now, don't, don't remind me. Um, this stuff was called smooth stone. But now, for some unknown reason, when you get the actual smooth stone, it looks completely different. It was an, unob uh, it was an unobtainable block that you used to not be able to get in any way, unless you were in creative. I don't really need spectral arrows. And it like it, it doesn't make me mad. I'm like I'm kinda halfway joking, but it's like why did they name it why did they change the name to stone and they made the other stuff like not smooth st like why why can't it, this be smooth stone? This has been smooth stone or it was smooth stone for like four years, okay? And I remember Minecraft as it was four years ago. Okay, you gotta remember I'm a I'm a Minecraft boomer, as they say. You know, I, I don't like to throw around the term boomer lightly, but I am a literal Minecraft boomer. And I would just like to know why they Okay, well, enough enough with the, the ramp, but check this out. Look. What is that noise? What is that noise? Oh, it's raining. <laughs> I was like, what is that noise? It didn't sound like rain, truthfully. Um, but yeah, this is what I get to do for the next little while. So I hope... Well, just here. I'll let you watch me for like 15, 20 seconds, and then I'll stop recording, okay? Oh no, <laughs> that's the wrong pickaxe. I'm sorry if you was kind of, you know, ASMR and out there, and then I just like started laughing like a doofus in your ear. Um, yeah, I know some people are always like, me, I want to see more of the block breaking, but then I think a good majority don't really want to see it. Um, but I'm glad I'm finding all this coal because I genuinely need coal. Um, that's one thing that I've just been short on. And we're going to have to use our super smelter to smelt all this stone up uh, into sm smooth stone. Um, <laughs> I say it painfully and. I say it because at a distance because I don't believe in my heart that it is smooth stone. I never will. Smooth stone will always be this stuff right here to me. Like, so my pickaxe is about to die. <clears throat> I haven't even really mined any more stone since you saw me last because my pickaxe is, is, is about to die. So I think I'm going to have to go over to one of my spawners somewhere. Because, um, I mean, obviously I cannot sustain that forever because we're going to end up with a uh, big old broken pickaxe. So, I'm trying to decide which spawner I want to go to, and I have to run by this stuff here. Maybe I can dig it down. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. No one loves you, dude. And then I'll even cover it up just to show the utter disrespect. I probably should leave it open, actually, because we're going to need to use that again. Um, how am I going to find this thing, you ask? Yeah, I don't know. Let me... <laughs> Let me <laughs> get something out of here. But yeah, we're going to have to repair our tools, basically, because otherwise it's just not going to work. So it's just kind of right in front of here. I'm sure I'm not going to miss this. But yeah, we got to fly over probably to our old base. Use our triple dungeon spawner. Well, no, that automatically kills him now. We'll use our spider spawner. So that thing honestly is really quick. Oh yeah, there's a big old beacon. I don't... <sighs> Sometimes, you know, people aren't always the smartest, okay? They're... So just... You just gotta... You just gotta... Yeah. <sighs> if only there was a beacon... You know, maybe I could build some sort of stone beacon to uh, show where where this thing was. You know, some sort of beacon <laughs> to guide me. <laughs> I'll meet you guys at the triple spider spawner. Okay, you know those big stone things in Mario? I, I grew up playing the Nintendo 64 quite a bit. And there's a game called Super Mario 64, you know, the OG. And I watched my brother play it a ton. I played it a ton. And it's they're, they're these big stone flat things. And when they fall over, they go like... Ooh, ooh, something like that. <laughs> Can someone tell me if that noise is accurate? Go search Nintendo 64 Big Stone Boy Falling and tell me, does it sound like ooh? Okay, now you guys are probably, if you don't know a Mar, you know, you're like, dude, what? What are you talking about? Like, what are you talking about? Don't worry about it. Okay, Let's, I, all I gotta say is just, just, can I make this flight all the way there? Yes! Dude, if I can make this all the way to my triple spider spawner, you have to leave a like on the video. You have to leave a like on the video. You have to leave a like on the video. You have to leave a like on the video, please. You don't actually have to, but I appreciate it. We made it all the way there, dude, on one glide, one rocket. Not really, we actually used quite a bit of rockets. Can I jump and... 
okay, probably shouldn't do that. Um, but yeah, I wanted to say this because I feel like I keep forgetting this. I feel like I'm, I'm regressing as a YouTuber. Would you guys mind subscribing to me? If, if you're watching this series and you notice you're not subscribed, I really would appreciate a subscription. Um, it just, it doesn't like give me money. It doesn't like, it's nothing like that. It's just, I really want to hit a million subscribers, guys. I, I had, a, you know, I've been doing this for nine years now. I've been a YouTuber for nine years. And like, yeah, I have a decently large channel, but for someone who's done this for nine years, uh, my channel's not like the biggest in the world, but I'm, but I'm happy with how, how, like how, how big I am. I'm not trying to be, you know, ungrateful. I'm just saying that I would really appreciate a subscription because I really, really want to reach one million subscribers. And I know it's kind of selfish, you know, maybe to a degree, but I really want to reach a million. And if you're honestly, if you're enjoying this series, then uh, surely it can't hurt, right? So let me sit here for like 10 minutes. I'll come back. We'll kill the stuff and uh, probably repair this pickaxe right here. That's really the only one I need repaired, I think. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys in just a bit. Please consider a subscription and a like on the video. I would appreciate it. Thank you. All right, let's see if it's been long enough. So it's kind of difficult to do this. Um, I'm going to take off any of my armor that, like, you know, needs to be repaired. That way the XP doesn't start to repair it. So I'm going to hold this in my offhand. And if I use my sword, like, this thing, it, it'll get repaired almost instantly. And then it should all go to my pickaxe. Like, I'm hoping, right? It's kind of hard to get the XP, too, here. Oh, man, I hate poison. I hate it just because it makes a noise for you guys. But see, look. XP. See, it's working. Now it's a 699. I didn't realize it doesn't have unbreaking on it. Um, maybe I should go buy the unbreaking enchant while I'm here and add it to it. I'm not sure why I didn't put unbreaking on it. I really, I can't for the life of me remember why I would have done that. Uh, maybe I should do that. I like this cave spider spawner. I just, dude, I am, I really am like the luckiest with spawners. Like I've, I've always found like doubles. I've found a triple this season. People always like, Neo, you cheat. And I'm like, dude, I'll be honest with you. If I cheat... Then I don't have fun. Like, I've, I've tried to tell you guys this, and if you don't want to believe me, it's okay. You believe what you want. Um, so this is enough, I think. Um, but I'm going to go see if we can get Unbreaking. Let, let's go check our villager uh, area. I think we have Unbreaking as an available trade. And if we have to fly up and grab some paper and get some emeralds, that's okay with me. I'm running the wrong way, aren't I? No. No, I'm not running the wrong way. Yeah, dude, we're good, bro. Okay, hold on. L let me get out of here first. So this definitely, if you can hear me... Mashing my space bar. That's definitely bad for your uh, It's bad for your space bar, but I think it's also equal. Maybe not bad for your space. Bar. Oh, that's right I was like, why can't I fly? Uh, I was gonna say it's probably bad for your uh, For your hunger saturation like roast through your hunger real quick uh, So let's fly over here to the villager trading area, and I'm pretty sure we have unbreaking available I don't think we have enough emeralds. Did I just see a spider? I was gonna say dude. I haven't seen a mob in here in, in a good bit and no, I don't think actually, we, I don't think we'd have to go up there. We have quite a bit of paper ready to go right there. So, guys, 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 I, I would like you to uh, understand I'm here, and I know it's been a long time. I know I've been away for quite a while, but I need something from you. I need uh, some unbreaking. You got it? You have it? You have it? I know one of these guys has it. Are you serious? Wait, we don't have an unbreaking trade in here? Wait, we actually don't? I see that this guy is random. Oh. What? Okay, so we have it. It's just not labeled. Well, that's good to know. And it's only 19 emeralds. Why did we not add this to our pickaxe earlier? Does someone have an answer? Did I like, did I forget or something? You know what, guys? Have some string and have some, have some spider eyes. You, you deserve it. <laughs> I love I just leave these guys. I've been gone for like three months and they're just chilling here. They're like, okay, whatever. They have food and water, kind of. Well, actually, they're surrounded by water. I don't actually know if they have water or not. Um, is there is there still an anvil in here? Yeah, there is two anvils in here still. Okay, give me unbreaking three. Basically, I think triples, like, pretty much uh, triples your uh, durability. So now, we're on breaking three. We can go back there and get more stone. So I'm going to go get stone. I'll meet you guys when I have enough stone because I think you guys are tired of me. But this I'm tired of this part of the episode just gathering stone, but we've done a lot of stuff already Okay, then we got to go gather a bunch of other stuff. But yeah, well, let me get the stone. and I'll come back All right guys. I am taking down the beacon of dreams the beacon of hope uh, We have three shulker boxes full to the brim with stone I'm trying my best not to call it smooth stone because that's what we're gonna be smelting it with our super smelter 
um, into. Um, we also got quite a bit of coal, which is good. It should be enough, I'm assuming. Um, just trust me, all of those are filled. We're not even going to put them up into here. It's honestly fine. And uh, hey, it's morning now. I was worried because it's night. You know, I don't like traveling at night. You never know what can happen in the, the darkness of Minecraft. It's also a really flat beach over here. This looks really nice. We'll do something with that. Do a little tropical, uh, little tropical getaway when we need to get away from our mansion life. Something a little more simple, maybe a nice... Are these... Did you lose your llama? <laughs> he only has one llama. The other one's like up... Hey, buddy, what do you... What happened there? What's the story here? Here, I'm gonna troll him. Hold on. Oh! <laughs> Okay, this isn't a troll anymore. This is like a murder. Oh gosh, okay, now we're running away. <laughs> I feel bad. I shouldn't just poke people with sharp arrows. That's not a good idea. Especially when it's just a, you know, a, a very useful, you know, villager, trader. What do they even call? I, I don't even want to remember what they're called. If I don't care about something, I won't even try to remember. It's not worth the effort. Uh, okay, so I put all the coal in here. Which I didn't realize. I, I kind of realized it's shulker shells. What is this? Make kelp farm to feed into coal line to make it on the second floor. That is something I do eventually want to do. Um, but just because I feel like that would be really fun. Um, to make like a, you know, make this thing sustainable, I suppose. How many extra stacks is that? Okay, not too many. Um, but this should be enough coal. Like, I, I actually, in fact, I know it is enough coal. I'm going to put all the beacon stuff in here. I feel like it's a, you know, somewhat of a portable beacon. So, we'll like put it like that. That'll, uh... That'll organize it well enough for me. And then we get to throw all the stone type materials into here. Now, <laughs> we do have quite quite a, quite a bit of stone. Um, oh, there's a carpet there. I was like, why can't I open it? Um, so, yeah. I don't know if, like, if this is going to be done in, like, a long time. We're going to have to stick around here, though, obviously, for a while for this thing just to run. I think I'm going to have to go in there and push the manual start button because I think that it's already stopped again. Every time I unload the chunks, I need to build something uh, to make it work because it just, like, quite frankly, right now, it just doesn't work. Can I please? Okay, hold on. I'm sorry. I had to be able to put that stone up. It was bothering me. So let's go in. Oh, no. Is this still running? Is just one of them running? Where's the other minecart? Oh, only one of them is running for some reason. I'm not sure how that works. Um, but we'll go over here and we'll just kind of hit it a little bit and hope that this works. Will that will that make it start correctly? I don't know. Mm. Yeah, you know what? Close enough. I am proud of this thing. I did go on my server recently, which, if you didn't know, I have a Minecraft server. And I really love to see you on there. Neodude.net. But the problem is, you gotta be on Java. So you can't play on your phone or your console. You gotta be on the computer. But come uh, join my 1.18 survival SMP server. It's just neodude.net. I'd love to see you around on there. It's uh, it's pretty fun. We got a good community. Got a good community of staff. And uh, the server has been, you know, down on players lately. But it's probably because I have not mentioned it too much. So this is me mentioning it. You guys should hop on the server. Come check it out. But yeah, I'm gonna have to wait for all this to smelt. I think while we're doing that, we can do some other preparations. Namely, I, it's just stuff that you're not gonna want to see. I need to look for some dyes, stuff like that. I think I'm gonna get out literally every shulker box and go through them and look because I've gotten to the point where my shulker boxes are very, how you say, misorganized. Um, they're very all over the place. You know, I have things in boxes that shouldn't be there. So I guess I'm just gonna place them all down like this. And I'm literally going to go through and open every single one because we need some lime green dye. We need some yellow dye. We need some black dye. We need so much stuff and stuff that I cannot figure out where it is. I don't remember. But let's just put all these down and see how they look again because they always look pretty. Um, at least I think so. And I also want to make a banner, but I need, I think, yellow dye and something else. I cannot remember for the life of me. Um, okay, hold on. L let me organize. Now, I'm going to be looking in all of these. You can skip ahead if you don't want, but I know this is my food chest. This is where I always grab all the steak. That's why I always have a full stack of steak. Um, it's getting smaller and smaller. I may have to do something about that. Like, what is this? You know what I mean? Like, it's a block box filled with random blocks, I guess. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> that's accurate. Uh, so, that's, uh, that's that chest. Okay. A redstone box, a light box. Now this one's nice. This is where we got our glowstone out of. A live box, boom box, wood box. Yeah, this is where we get the rockets. T 
toolbox. I'm surprised we haven't run out of rockets yet. I have I have actually crafted rockets, so that's probably why. Toolbox, sandy. There's just so much stuff we have. Like look at all this iron. Why, why why do we who needs that much iron? And why is this one filled with <sighs> So yeah, I see nothing that we really realistically need here. Uh, we don't need too much dyes or anything like that. And I wish I could put this block back in my oh. I just opened the perfect. I, I didn't. I just. I, I promise. I just randomly clicked that one. Um, so how, how does this look? Okay, so we have that much stone. We have a lot of things in here. I almost want to craft a chest so that we don't have to like. So I'm gonna take that. And then I'm gonna take a stack. Nope. I should just take the chests that are already in here. Um, I I, I just want to put a chest right here just to put the things that have already smelted because like I don't need all the glass. I don't need all the copper, and I don't need this stuff. I just want to put this just right here. And just let it go. Um, because let it go. No, but I, I don't, I don't need all this stuff. So we'll just put that in there. I don't know why 53 stone is in there. We're going to put that in there. Um, I think I'm, I think I've lost a couple ender chests, honestly. We're going to leave that one there. So we need to get some dyes and I have to let this thing run though. But like we do need some dyes. So I'm going to go and run around and get those. We need some yellow dyes and I don't really know how to get, oh my gosh. <laughs> no, 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 sir. No, sir. I do not want your business. No, sir. Go ahead and get, <laughs> go ahead and get out of here. Jeez, dude. He was at my door. Literally. Um, we need a couple of dies. Is that, was that another one? Excuse me, sir. Also, I want to see how much iron is in this thing. Um, because we've sat here for quite a while with a bunch of other projects. I'm just curious, like how much iron is accumulated? Because uh, it has, I think, like, three or four double chests that it can go into. So, it's never going to be more full than that. But, like, we got to have quite a bit of iron accumulated. But yeah, I need lime green dye, I need yellow dye, and then black dye. Okay, so, like, a lot, but, like, not too, too much. Okay. So, let me get these dyes figured out. Because I don't know. I guess you need cactus green and white dye, I think. Right? Cactus green. But we, I thought we had cactus green dye. Ah, oh, I don't know. Hold on. Okay, so I'm coming all the way back here because I know I have cactus green dye because this thing, like, literally is a cactus farm. And I don't want to smelt any of that cactus because I know I have a ton of cactus dye. I just, I cannot for the life of me remember if it's in this. I mean, it's not in my, you know, uh, inventory management system. It's not in my shulker boxes. So I think it's, I think it's like right here. With the, I think it might be the thing with the lime green dye on it. I don't know the, oh. Really? I don't have any green? The only color I need? And why do I only have one lime green dye? Is it in? Oh, it's in here. I was like, dude, there is absolutely no way. And we don't even need that much. We just need like maybe that much. And is it white plus? Oh my gosh, I don't have any bones in here. Could we do have white dye? Is it white plus green? That's all I need to know. Okay, that makes lime green dye. That's fine. I'm just going to get more than I think I'll need. And now we just need some yellow dye, which I don't think that we have. So we'll, that'll be enough. Uh, we do need some yellow dye, which we definitely don't have. So we're going to have to go find some yellow flowers. Uh, we just need yellow. And then how do you get black dyes from squid ink, right? I'm pretty sure it's from squid ink. We have a little bit in here. We'll have to go, we'll have to go hunt squid, which I'm never a big fan of. Well, luckily, we really don't need very much black dye at all. We do also have to be careful, though. I'm going to fly up here. I'm going to make some fireworks to put in my inventory because we're going to run out for sure. Ah, I love this thing. I still can't believe we built this. I, st I, I just... So many trap doors. Where are all the creepers? I only see one creeper. There we go. There we go. Let's keep on working. Yeah, there's some creepers. Um, I'm pretty sure this is going to already have like a ton of uh, stuff accumulated. Oh, we can't look up there. Shut that in case a creeper gets up there. All you have to do, really, is just come in here and uh, grab a bunch of gunpowder, which I seem to have avoided grabbing. And then you just grab some sugar cane, which I guess I don't really have a whole lot of. I'm never really up here, to be fair. These chunks haven't been loaded too, too often. Um, honestly, I'm always, you know, off in my new mansion. You know, the upper echelon of life, living at my mansion. Um... So let's go over here. Let's just craft some of this. We're the the old school way. You guys know how it is. Crafting by hand. We, we don't actually have any automatic crafting. 
There we go. That'll that'll be enough. I I don't want to waste it. I'll just throw it in here. That's fine. This should be enough rockets. Okay, and I don't need this. I'll keep that. Uh, should be good. So now, let's go hunt squid. That's the thing I don't like hunting because they're just boring. So I'm going to kill some squid. Don't mind me. Squid! Dude, we dove straight on these squid. They're like, oh my gosh. Now, let's see. If we just kill this like pocket of squid and we have looting three, let's see how many uh, how many ink sacks that, that yields for us. Uh, they're still floating around. Okay, this, this guy's a part of the pocket, right? Sure. Let's see, how much squid ink is this? So that was 19. Okay, so this isn't going to take that long. Yeah, let me hunt some squid. And one thing we don't have is a trident, and I'm not saying that because this guy has a trident or anything, because he doesn't. But I really want to get a trident. I feel like that's just something I... Whoa, he went down quick. I feel... Oh my gosh, you really don't want to die. I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, but I have not had a trident in survival, I don't think, ever. Maybe, like, when they first came out, I got one or something, but I cannot for the life of me remember having one. And, uh, supposedly they're pretty cool if you get the Riptide enchant and you can, like, fling yourself in and out of water. Or, like, when it's raining, you can pretty much fly. You know, if you have an Elytra, obviously, it's different, but, like, I want to try to get one at some point. I just don't know how. I know they just spawn randomly, but, like, I don't know. I only saw one in this whole series so far that had, uh, had a, had a Trident. Not Elytra. How to try it. Alright, let me keep, keep going. I just got bored. Sorry. Okay, that's definitely enough. That's like 51. Yeah, that's definitely enough. Now we need to get yellow dye. Which you probably need like a similar amount. I don't really know where you get yellow dye, I'll be honest with you. Um, I'm going to go back over to our old base though. Or not our old base, our mansion. Because I'm 99% sure that it can just spawn in the oak wood forest next to us. So I'll meet you guys back over there. Okay, well, I just saw some yellow flowers from the sky, so I'm going to grab these. We don't need, like, a whole ton, and if you looked at my Instagram, you already know kind of what this is for, but you don't really know, like, the whole the whole story. I really am going to make you go on my Instagram to find out. So this is where we were shearing the sheep, if you don't remember getting all that wool um, for the carpet, I think, and then we figured out we could just breed them, uh, you know. The, the good old days. There's literally there's hardly any yellow flowers. Oh, as I say that, I see a big patch of them. These do give you yellow, right? Like I'm just I'm just checking because sometimes things happen you just don't expect it. Um, and I actually we may need more than I was talking about because we have to make a ton of lime green dye as well. You don't even know what the lime green is for. You guys, maybe if you maybe if you see my Instagram post and you know that I'm crafting lime stuff now, then you you maybe you have an idea. But I can promise you, I searched it on YouTube, it's never been done before. People have built these in Minecraft, but not in the, not for the purpose I'm building one. Um, and it's going to be super cool. Like, I'm so excited. And I'm sorry to tease you guys, but it, the episode is coming out tomorrow. So, if you're not subscribed and you don't want to miss what I've been preparing for this whole episode, please do hit the subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. I feel like I just don't encourage people to subscribe enough. And I sometimes I'll just watch, like, you know, people, you know, that, <laughs> you know, they're like YouTube self-help videos, right? They're like, you know, how to grow a channel successfully. You know, they're, they're not really for, like, me, but, like, I still learn a lot of stuff. I always try to learn and improve as a creator. And I just, like, it's like I've learned these things and I've just forgotten them. I never ask people to subscribe. And there's just, there's, there's just certain kinds of people out there, and, and they're not bad people, they're just, they're just different. They just don't do, like, they don't think about subscribing. It doesn't mean they're bad or anything, they just don't think about subscribing, right? And, like, unless you say, or remind them, you know, to maybe, you know, think about subscribing. Don't tell them to subscribe, but if you just kind of put it in their minds, then maybe they'll subscribe to you. But if you never say anything, how are they going to think about it? They're just going to forget, and then they'll never find your channel again. So, if this is your first video you're watching from me, please do subscribe. That's all I'm going to say. I may say it again in the the outro of the video just because, you know, it's, uh, <laughs> it's, I have my outro. I think I tell people to subscribe in the outro, but most people don't watch the end of the videos. Like, seriously, probably, like, only 10% of the people who watch my videos watch the entire video, right? Uh, which is fine. Like, I, I, that's how all YouTube videos are. I'm just saying that people don't really hear that in the end. That call, it's called a call to action. That's what it's called. I was trying to think of it the whole time, this whole time. Um, and I don't know how many flowers I need. I know I need quite a bit of lime green. So I'm going to keep getting flowers. And uh, when I'm done, I'll meet you guys back at the mansion. Because it is not the most fun thing in the world to collect flowers. But yeah. See you in a bit. Okay. Well, I literally have the maximum amount of flowers I can carry. So 
don't know how many that is, but it should be enough. The bone box is going to have all the white dye that I need. So we should be in a good position here if I don't end up killing myself by uh, kinetic energy or whatever it's called when you slam into the ground with an elytra. Um, again, I may have to restart this thing over here because I unloaded these chunks. Let's just find out. Are you still going? Are both minecarts still going? Um, no, this one's not going. Okay, so we have to send this one. I don't know why only like one will fail versus the other one. I, I really don't know. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think the ender chest is going to end up in here. Yeah. Uh, also, you know what I could do that I haven't done? Maybe I could make this thing called a stair or just like a slab or something. I'm probably going to use a stair. We just need one. And I, oh, I guess I don't have any room. I'll just throw it on the ground. I'll, I'll come get it in a second. I just want to put a stair here because I always end up putting a block here anyways. Might as well just throw a stair down just for convenience sake. So, we gotta deal with all these dyes. I need to make a ton of lime green dye. It's really simple, right? You just put it in here and you get yellow. It's it's really not too hard. And then you combine uh, yellow and green and, or wait. Oh, no, we just need just raw yellow dye. That's right, sorry. The green and then the white, but we need to get, hold on. Which one of these chests had chests? Or which one of these ender, I can't remember the name, which one of these shulker boxes had chests? We'll just put up all this stuff for a second because I'm getting confused. Now we're going to take our green dye, which uh, we'll do this much and then we need our bones. Probably not that many because they give you so much white dye. There we go. And uh, then we just combine it and we make lime green dye. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to get all the dyes that we need again just like this and this and you get lime green dye. It's pretty sweet. Pretty easy. And I don't know how exactly how much we need. We're just going to bring all this material with us to the end. We're going to go make a cool end entrance in here in just a moment. Um, I just got to keep making this die. So, okay. So this is all the die that we need. And then we just need to make it into concrete. And I'm pretty sure, pretty sure we have sand and a bunch of like variety of chests just randomly strewn about. I don't remember. I feel like I just saw the sand. Yeah, there's tons of sand in here and we need to make a little bit of concrete. May seem like <laughs> that may seem like more concrete than we need. I don't know. Uh, we need yellow concrete and we need black concrete, and we're gonna need something called a crafting table. So a crafting table allows you to craft things. Um, you put it on the ground. Okay, so we need yellow concrete, like this. Uh, what do we need more? Sand. We need more gravel. Okay, and make the yellow concrete. I guess I could just like. Can I just? There we go. No, wait, why did it not pull all the... Oh, because I didn't have more yellow dye? I never... I, I will never understand how this crafting thing works. Right, so we have yellow concrete. Shift click. Oh, there we go. Wow, that's a lot of yellow concrete. Okay, we need black concrete. Okay. That's a lot of black concrete. I don't think we need any more than that. Um, that's all the concrete we actually need. So we maybe... <laughs> maybe we got too much. I don't remember how much we need. <gasps> Try to think. Maybe like... We may need like this much yellow concrete and then black concrete really need like maybe this much right here. So I'm going to turn this all into the concrete form. Now it's very easy. You just have to have a water bucket, which we have in our inventory. I'm also going to throw this back on the ground, throw that on the ground. You just have to do this, right? And then you just look, you put this here, you put the water bucket down and then all you have to do is like put the concrete in offhand, hold both the left and right down at the same time. Like this and then look if you don't mess up look easy peasy so let me do this for all the concrete one sec dude it's seriously such a good feeling knowing i'm finally done doing that i'm not gonna lie it's kind of painful to do but it's much quicker than doing it any other way that i've personally found um i think that whoever left it on a comment i think it was freak a leak I think he, one of my long-standing mods and friends, community members in the community, and it, it like, he like, dude, you could just do this, and I was like, what? And I tried it, and it worked, and I was like, bruh, bruh, why doesn't everyone do this? Okay, so, I got all this stuff set up. We still need a little bit of black concrete and a little bit of yellow dye, or not black concrete. Uh, we need some yellow dye, so let me go grab that real quick, and I'll come back, and uh, we'll do it. <gasps> Sorry, I keep hiccuping. Does anyone else get stuck on a loop and like watch YouTube shorts for two hours straight? See, I always like, I didn't have TikTok for years. So I was like, I'm never going to get it. And I, 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 and I, I don't really use TikTok, but then I, <laughs> I clicked on the shorts button on my phone one time and it just, oh man, I can get stuck watching YouTube shorts for like two hours straight. It's, it's, it's very bad. It's not good for your health. 
It's like literally like pumping you with the most content. It's like it's like condensed content. Does that make sense? You know, condensed milk is like really sweet. You know, you know what I mean. It's just like condensing anything. It's just you know videos condensed to 60 seconds or less. It's not good. It's uh, it's it's like it's not that it's bad, but it's like very like addicting to your brain because you get so much dopamine from watching it, and it uh, it, it rewards your brain. You know, your brain feel good, so you want to keep watching. Uh, maybe we don't even need that much black dye. Okay, I think we're fine. Also, do I have... Do I have a door over here still? What the heck? I don't, I don't have a door. No, I have a... <laughs> I have a hole in my wall that I never fixed. I said I was going to fix it like two or a week ago when I recorded. I never fixed it. Okay, let me craft a few things. Hold on. All right, now I'm going to do something I've never done before. We have a loom and we have a banner. I've never made banners before in my entire time playing Minecraft. But I am going to make a kind of a teaser thing, sort of, here. I may need to make another banner for this. So we're going to do this thing first. I'm going to have to watch... Oh, hold on, hold on. Okay, so I literally have a YouTube tutorial playing next to me. Okay, so what's the next step? Hold on. Uh, Okay, a triangle. Okay. And then what? I'm sorry, I'm watching this video as we go. And then he's scrolling down and he's doing one of these. Okay. You know what? Do we need yellow still? Yeah? No, black, black, black. Which one did he click? Hold on, dang it. Okay, so he puts this in here with the black one and then clicks. There's a bottom triangle, okay? And then what? And then he goes yellow and a bottom half one. Yellow and a bottom half one. Okay. And then he does yellow again and a top half one. Okay, does this end up with what I'm... Where's the top half one? Okay. Hey, it actually worked. Okay, cool. So, I guess if you didn't go to my Instagram, now you kind of have the hint. But this is what's happening tomorrow, guys. It's a it's a nuclear symbol. <laughs> Do you know what it's going to be? <laughs> I don't know. It's going to be pretty cool, though. So, I hope to see you guys in tomorrow's episode. Thank you guys for watching. I'm going to have to sit here for quite a while and uh, let this bad boy run. I assume it's still running. I like to go in here and check every once in a while because I'm, I'm just paranoid. Um... It's go oh, it looks like all the stone is finally into there. So, I guess we're gonna have to load more stone up, which- Oh, that's right, I can't- I don't know why I keep putting one down there when I can never- Okay, we're gonna- <laughs> have to put up a few things here. And we're not gonna need. At least at the moment, currently. But yeah, thank you guys for watching again. Uh, I really do appreciate each and every one of you. You don't have to subscribe, but if you would uh, think about it and maybe subscribe, I would appreciate it. But if you just watch the videos and you don't subscribe or, you know, you don't have an account or anything like that, don't worry about it. I still appreciate you just as much. Your viewership means the world to me. Thank you guys for watching again. I hope that everyone has a wonderful day, the rest of the day today. And uh, tomorrow, we're going to be doing something very nuclear. So uh, get excited. It's going to be really fun. And uh, I'm hyped to show you what I'm gonna do tomorrow you'll see based on the thumbnail tomorrow because I think it's gonna be a banger video anyways oh yeah we didn't do something I said I was gonna do we're gonna go do that now it's actually gonna be I think this may extend the video by like 20 minutes I don't know <laughs> I actually don't know first of all let me go find the coordinates to our end portal because I need to I, I, I know I have a picture on my phone I just gotta find it so hold on okay so 900 negative like around negative 1500 because it's not the, I'm trying to find the exact end portal I the stronghold whatever I, I don't really need to find that so it looks like it's this way and then negative 1500 which looks like this way okay so I just need to fly to 900 negative 1400 or 1500 something like that I did find the corner I hope these are the right coordinates I don't quite know what else would be inside of a stronghold where I'd have f3 pulled up so we're on day 647 of this world so Maybe I'll make a thousand days update whenever we get to a thousand days and just uh, kind of show off everything we've done. But, you know, to be fair, a lot of that time was spent AFKing, um, which, you know, I don't know. I mean, you have to AFK, right? Yeah, so it is definitely around here. I don't even need the coordinates anymore. It's literally right there. So you guys remember we made this hole, but just locked my phone and everything. That's how confident I am in this. Remember, we made a hole like right around here. Yeah. You guys remember. I remember. You remember. We remember. Um, remember this was like, you know, not where we wanted to be. So we kept going down and, uh, I don't even think this was, oh my gosh, creeper. Oh man, please don't do it to me, creeper. <laughs> okay. Uh, so yeah, this is the stronghold and I think, I think it was up and over. I don't remember. I just want a direct path to our end portal. If we're going to build something cool in the end, 
Maybe that gives you even more of a hint. Then uh, I, I really do want to have a path to it. Now, I, oh man, I really honestly don't remember. I thought I had like a shortcut to it. Wait, is that this right here? Or is this the thing we just went up? This is the thing we just went up. Yeah, and we were freaking out about the creeper. Yeah, I don't know what I'm thinking. I don't know exactly where it is. I'm pretty sure, is it over here? I'm gonna break this door. No, it's not over here. Okay, we're gonna put the door back. I think the end portal's over here and to the left. Maybe it's like down here and then to the left. It's something like this. It's, it's, it's not very far away yet. So it's like right over here, but I wanna build like a direct path to this thing. So first of all, let me grab some materials. So like, uh, yeah, I'm fine keeping that. I just wanna grab some stone brick, just real quick. And I wanna put this stone brick on top of the portal so that I don't fall in the portal and die. I won't die, but like I really don't want to go in there because I don't remember the bed I slept in last. I think it was in my old base. And I would much rather not spawn back over there. So we'll just put this here. Whatever we don't use, we can just throw in there. It'll end up in the end, I think. And now we just need to dig this hole right here. We just need to go straight up so that we can have a direct path into the end. Oh, uh, please don't tell me it's full of water. <laughs> it's going to be full of water, actually. Oh, no. Uh, so maybe we'll build an opulent path another episode or I'll build this in between episodes This is not going to be super fun. I just want to have a big hole that goes down into the into the um, Into the area is that too much to ask for I think not uh, But yeah, I just realized this is gonna be a very boring process. Let me finish going up to the sky first Okay, we're up to the surface and it's storming Lightning storming and I'm in the water So I'm a little nervous, you know cuz you always get told you're not supposed to be in water when it's storming um, so I feel kind of, you know, spooked about that. Looks like there's quite a few mobs around here. Probably because this island is dark. I might light up this island a little bit. Might be a, might be a wise idea. Just because if we ever go to this area at night, I'd like, which, you know, I think I'll be going over to this area quite a bit after I build this thing, just to look at it. Um, it's gonna take quite a bit of, uh, effort. Whoa! You guys saw it, like, as I zoomed in, it disappeared, but you saw lightning just struck right there. We could have died. I could have just died. Oh my gosh, I could have just died, dude. Now, I don't know how often I have to put torches down anymore. People say, you know, you can really space them out. I just don't know. Like, this looks pretty dark to me, but, like, I don't, I just, I genuinely don't know. I'm about to run out of, <laughs> I'm about to run out of torches. I mean, to be fair, though, like, I just, I almost had a heart attack. I was like, where did my inventory go? Jeez. You guys slow down a little bit. I almost had a heart attack because I was like, where'd all my stuff go? I just, I forgot. I put all of my chests down. Okay, so that should be enough. It should be fine. So this is my fancy entrance that I built so far. It's okay. I think we'll save it for another, uh, another day that we build like the fanciest of fancy entrances. Now you can't really get up and down this thing, which might be a problem. Maybe I should go and get some wood and build a, like a ladder or something. Yeah, let's go do that before we go down here. That way we can actually get up and down. Ooh, look how fancy, guys. Better watch out here. We have the fanciest entrance of them all. Uh, hope I don't need any more. Okay, I gotta get out of here. I'm about to get struck, dude. Straight up about to get struck. That is uncomfortable, to say the least. I could steal torches from this unsuspecting village, but... I think, okay, where's my axe? I think I'll just get wood from this nice acacia, this nice acacia wood area, acacia tree. These are not acacia, are they? Not acacia. Yeah, acacia. I haven't picked up any acacia logs this whole series. Huh, okay, let me get some. I'm not gonna lie, guys, I almost died. <laughs> I was unsuspecting, you know, I was just mining some wood, just chilling out, and all of a sudden these creepy boys roll up on me, and uh, I didn't know, I didn't know how to handle, oh, don't steal my wood, idiot. Um, I didn't know how to handle myself. I thought I was dead. Also, I think I found a cave over here, which would be kind of sweet if I could... Oh, I literally just saw coal. I was going to say, kind of sweet if I could, like, find some coal so I can make a few torches. Really, one piece of coal. I was going to say, dude, what kind of coal vein are you if you only have one piece of coal? And, uh, now I can hopefully just make a few torches, just like this. Bada bing, bada boom. Torches in the room. Let's go. So now we don't have to worry about, you know, not being able to see. And I can hopefully light up the rest of my island. Uh, I have 39 ladders. I feel like that's not enough. I, I don't know. I'll, I'll get a few more. Oh my gosh, the creepers, dude. Um, I'll get a few more pieces of wood. 
I don't know. I okay. <laughs> I keep. I'm like I don't know if I uh, if I sense creepers around me, but I get this uncomfortable feeling sometimes uh, w when the creepers are near, and uh, it's like I know something's about to happen. Can you guys? Can you? Can you? Can you? Can you chill out? Uh. I wonder if is this enough wood? I know this is long-winded. I need to end the episode. Just let me let me have my fun. It's been a while since I recorded, so I've been, I'm having a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, that's definitely enough ladders. Okay, let's fly back home. Yeet. I went back and watched the old Yeet vines, you know, to figure out or not figure out, but just to remember where Yeet came from. Dude, some of those are pretty good. You know, Yeet. <laughs> just like. Uh, I know it's like, you know, that's like a boomer meme now or whatever. It's just like old. But, you gotta respect it, dude. You gotta respect the origins. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna build a ladder down to there. I think it's pretty self-explanatory. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in tomorrow's episode. Alright, bye guys! Okay, I know I said bye already, but look. Ladder to the end portal. There you go. Hopefully that, that satisfies you enough. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Please leave a like, subscribe if you want. Bye! I'm not gonna lie, dude. I'm flying back home. Oh! Oh! I was I was saying I saw a skeleton horse in on the roof of this tree area, but no, I've never seen this happen in like you know real real my I, I happened to my okay. These guys may actually prove to be a little bit tough here. I've never seen these. Can I hit just the skellies off and get the bone horses myself? Can you can you stop? Can I just get the? Can I just get the? Oi! Oi! Why is this so hard? Why are there so many creepers? No! Almost died twice. I know the episode's over, but I saw that skeleton horse on the... And I was like, no way it's going to strike again. And then boom, as I recorded. That was pretty cool, though. I think these things are pretty rare, right? Well, I'll, I'll remember the coordinates, okay? How about that? Okay, now I fly home because I'm scared. I'm scared. Why can't I fly? Oh, that's right. I took it off. Please! Okay. Dude, the lightning is crazy. No! Forest fire! <laughs> Oh, that's from lava. Never mind. I don't care.